the quarantine measures are a, uh, a measured public health response. Now that we have seen the infection rate coming down, the death rate coming down in this country, and we are controlling the virus here, it's another measure to make sure that we don't put that at risk and risk a second wave. But uh, you'll see more details on that from the Home Secretary later today. What this does is requires people coming into this country um, to register um, where they will be located for that 14 day quarantine period. And then again, requires them to adhere to it. And of course, if they get symptoms to take that test and follow the instructions that come with that. I think what we're trying to do here is come up with a scheme. And I think we have done that is practical, which is um, enforceable and works and which actually will help us again, continue to control the virus and its risk of transmission in this country. Well, air corridors, I know, are something that's being explored by the Transport Secretary and the Home Secretary. And essentially, this is where two countries have an agreement that they are both satisfied that the infection rates in each country are low and under control and that they have processes in place to contain and uh, trace and test for the disease. And therefore, that then allows for an easier um, passage for people between those countries.